what is going on guys it's your boy domes here and today i have a brand new video for you guys today i have a brand new sensitivity video best controller settings whatever you want to call it but these are my best settings all right so 28 28 28 10 3 1 now if you guys don't know the inner dead zone is pretty much how sensitive your analog sticks are all right so if your analog sticks are super sensitive, you want to, you know, you want to go with three or, you know, maybe four. All right. Um, these are the rest of my settings. Omni off triggers, quick tap. All right. You guys can pause the video if you guys are trying to look through everything. Aim assist. I play with it off and on. Now, what I mean by that is if I'm playing a sweaty ass pub team and I can tell they have aim assist on, I'll turn it on. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I'll definitely turn it on. I don't want them to, you know beat my ass when aim assist off but then i'm just playing casually you know just trying to warm up or you know just trying to play the game you know it's nothing, nothing too crazy i'll play with it off all right gore i play with it on you guys know why the executions on gears look so good so for the purpose of this video though i'm gonna have it off but you guys just at least you guys know gore usually i have it on now this is how fast i can wall bounce with these settings you know, it's not my fastest wall bounce, all right? I'm not trying to show off how fast I can wall bounce, but I'm trying to, show, I'm trying to give you guys a little gist of how it's going to look, all right? So you're in a dead zone. Remember, it's how sensitive your analog stick starts. If you guys want to, you know, put the best settings for yourself, start off with zero, all right? And do what I'm doing in this video, guys. I go up by one until it stops moving. So what you guys want to do is you guys want to start off with zero and gradually go up by one until it stops moving by itself. Now, now if it's not moving by itself, move it a little bit right and see if it moves by itself once you move it a little bit if it still doesn't move when you move it a little bit that means it's perfect right now i have it on three i move it a little bit boom it's not moving by itself no more so stick to that you know what i mean now the outer death zone zero to one is fine you don't want to go any higher than that um me personally i play with it on one but that's because it's gears three i've had it on one but i wouldn't mind keeping it on zero like right now i'm gonna try out zero for the rest of the today to see how it goes but zero to one is fine you don't want to go any higher you want to go any lower i think that's completely fine now your dead zone like i said is preference um you guys need to choose what you guys want like i said start with zero and gradually go up and like i said guys 28 28 28 10 3 0 10 3 1 is my current settings i don't really mess with it outside of that i was i used to play on 30s but i'm gonna be honest guys when this new update came out, I feel like this is the best settings for me. I'm gonna show you guys a few clips and how I hold my controller. All right, so this is how I hold my controller, guys. Nothing too crazy. You have you guys have different methods, of, you know, holding your controller. This is just how, how how I hold it. I play claw, and if you guys don't feel comfortable playing claw, I'm gonna show you guys different ways you guys can hold your controller while playing claw. All right, so while you're playing claw, you're pretty much your pointer finger is going on a and it's pressing a x b and y all right and the middle finger is going to be on rt and lb now remember you can either slant your finger on the on the controller you can literally lay your controller you know you can lay your finger on the controller or you can you know use your pointer finger and have it pointing upwards i think powers plays like that where his pointer finger is aiming forward like a little bit not forward but it's not it's not laying on the analog sticks you know what i mean I think summons also plays like that where his analog, you know, his finger isn't laying on the controller itself. Me personally, guys, the way I claw, my finger is a little bit long, my thumb. So it overlaps on an analog stick. And yeah. And then this is how I shoot my pistol. All you guys been asking me, how do I shoot my pistol? You know, I usually play, I go back to default thumbs and I tend to just use my middle finger to press the RT. Now, here's a clip of me using my, um, my trigger finger in game so you guys see how fast my you know my pistol is because of the way i hold my controller when i am using my pistol so i hope you guys enjoyed the video that is it for the video guys comment down below let me know how you guys feel and it's been your boy domes leave me some suggestions down below guys i love you guys peace
Hop inside an Audi, then I did the dash. dash. Shorty know I only care about the cash. cash. Big dance, big sticks, big rash. She asked me how I got it, said I got it like that. I get it when I wanna, smoking marijuana. Keep it hotter than a sauna, smoking till the sun up. They asked me if I have bands, I said bring your funds up. They tested me to a chunk, and they didn't show up. Where they at though? How about at your party, and I got the stick tuck. You just walked out on your skateboard looking like a dumb fuck. Mama told me get a bag, and I said run it up. With the naughty and a jack, but I need a bench truck. I need real cheese, big ass peso Don't fuck with me, or this fucking bankroll Got a 4.0, GPA on the road Beating up and down the freeway Didn't pay a single toll